Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an advice video for you guys. Um, recently I went on a rant on an Instagram story talking about like relationships and guys and all that stuff. Um, so first things first, it's pouring outside. So if you hear any like um, lightning, right? No, if you hear thunder, there you go. If you hear any thunder or any rain, that's why. Um, also, there's people in my house, so you probably want to hear noises in the background. But anywho, so I don't want to make this video too long. Oh, also, I have a hat on because the rain fucked up my hair. Like, my hair is freezing now. It's very puffy, and I'm going to get it braided in, like, two days. So right now, we're just going to have to deal with the Adidas hat. But anyways, um... So basically what I want to talk about was, you know, I guess like things that I've been seeing on Instagram that guys have been posting. And if any guy feels offended by this, I really don't know what to tell you. If you're offended, it's probably because you're doing it. So if the shoe fits, you know the saying. So I've been seeing guys post online like, oh, um... Just a lot of stuff like I think now what's annoying is that a lot of guys claim that they want a serious relationship they want wifey type and then when they get wifey type they don't know how to keep her and it's almost kind of like you know why are guys expecting so much out of a female if they're not doing anything to like if they have nothing to offer so I guess I can talk about one experience I have. Like, I used to talk to this guy a while ago, like a while ago. And, um, basically, not even just him, like other guys too. They have the tendency to say, to tell a female that they don't want a relationship, right? But they'll post memes online talking about, like, relationships. Like, yeah, I need a girl like this, or damn if I really could get a girl like that or I need a girl to do this. like just little things like that is what irks me because it's like at the end of the day you're not really about that life you don't want a relationship why are you posting things like as if you are and it kind of clicked in my head and I was talking to a friend about this and I was like um I think that guys post things like that because it's a way for them to get females attention it's like an audience like they need a, a fucking audience they need val validation they seek attention and i feel like when guys post things like that like they need a girl to do x y and z a female will hit them up and be like oh you know like i can be that for you and then the guy might be like oh really and like it's like a trap to get women and it boosts their ego their self-esteem because they probably don't even realize it but them actually doing that is showing how low their self-esteem is and they are expecting women to have it all like be able to cook clean for them um like they can do whatever and at the end of the day it's okay because they have a woman to come back home to which i think is bullshit um and what else have I been seeing? Like, guys posting like, oh, like, I wish I could get a girl like that. And it's like, you had that, but when you had it, you didn't know how to keep it. Or, I don't know if it's like a mental thing. And I was talking to one of my guy friends about it. And he was like, yeah, like, it's like a mental thing. Like, it's like, it's like they know that they're not treating you right but they keep doing it because either you're allowing it or because of these other girls out there that boost their ego and they feel like they don't have to do a lot to get a girl which sucks because it's like i've spoken to guys that were like so attractive to me and they would play me like over and 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 i would get chances after chances after chances and now i'm becoming that girl like these other girls out here like they're making it easier for these guys and i feel like us women we have to really work hard not work hard 
we have to make a guy work to be with us like we can't just be giving ourselves so easily and you know it's okay if in the past you have like you know things happen you live and you learn but now if you're learning from your mistakes it's about that time to like all right you know what like i'm not gonna be dealing with this no more and it is what it is um my grandmother's talking in the background but anyways so also what i've been noticing is that like a lot of guys will nitpick at women for like showing their body on social media like showing their butt or their boobs or whatever the case is and that they don't have respect for themselves but those be the same guys i'll be posting pictures of them shirtless um dick prints out and it's like it's the same thing and i know they do it just to get attention and maybe some women do it to get attention and then some do it just because they feel confident in themselves whatever the case is i feel like as a guy if you do the same thing that women do don't bash women for it you know what i mean and at the end of the day you guys are fiending for them you're in their comments you're probably in their dm and you want to sleep with them nine times out of ten so don't 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 down talk on women that at the end of the day you're feeding for um and you can't expect to get a good woman if you're not a good man like you want a woman to just be like perfect but you know women want a guy that is well-rounded too like it you can't just sit here and be like yeah i want a good girl but you're not even a good guy you're not taking care of yourself meaning you're not taking time for yourself really taking time for yourself not talking to multiple females getting to know yourself fixing yourself as a man for the next female or the girl that you feel like deserves it and a lot of guys think like they see it as like yeah like you know i'm playing with her i'm playing with her i'm playing with her but you're wasting your time too and guys don't see it like that they see it like yeah you know like i got what i wanted that's it on to the next one but it's like you're wasting your time even and like even when guys like spend money on females just to make them feel special and they're like oh well it's okay because i'll get the money back next week like um you're dumb because you're still wasting your time some guys out here are weird like that like but um just a lot of things i've noticed over periods of time of dealing with guys like um and then i i also hate it too when like guys be like oh like you're so pretty why are you single and i'm like i'm single because of guys like you and they'll wonder why a female is single but they'll play them and then when the girl gets cuffed up they get tight and then you know what i mean and it's like okay but you're the same guy that's playing games you wasn't doing anything to have me and I feel like a lot of guys like you when a female is single because they see they see it as like, okay, I can hit her up whenever, I can flirt with her whenever. And the moment she gets cuffed up by someone else, they're tight. And it's like, but you weren't going to be that guy for her. So don't be selfish. A lot of these guys out here are selfish. I'm not saying every guy, but a lot of you are like that. And if you feel away about everything that I'm saying, it's probably because you're acting like this. And, you know age is nothing but a number i've dated guys that were five years older than me six years older than me and they act like babies okay you would think that they not really have their shit together but you would think that they're mature enough and then it makes you wonder like who raised you a lot of guys you know they want what they want and if they don't get what they want they get upset um I've dealt with guys where they feel like I'm doing too much. Like if I'm texting them and they're not texting me back, I'm like, hey, like, are you busy? Blah, blah, blah. Because I see that you're online, but you're not writing me back. Like, did the tree just fall? Wow. Um, wow. So, yeah, that happened to me before. I was like, oh, like, you're not texting me back, but I see that you're online. You know, like I'm trying to say like what's up, but I said it in the nicest way possible and he was like, Oh, I'm working and that just really turned me off. And um, you know, when I pick up my phone and to check it for a second, I don't have to text you 
you know, basically saying that like he's choosing to check Instagram before he checks his text messages to text me. And it's like, but if you really like me, you wouldn't be worried about posting on Instagram trying to follow up on instagram like you would be trying to follow up with me if i'm the girl that you're trying to commit to and this would be a guy that swore that he wanted a serious relationship and he'd be like why can't we just work out we can't work out because of you a lot of you guys like to blame girls you need to look at yourself in the mirror and ask yourself that dumb question like what is it about me every time this i bring this female around things don't work out and sometimes you can't always assume it's the girl's fault. You guys really need to take responsibility for your actions and really think, like, what am I doing wrong? And I feel like a lot of guys, I keep saying a lot of guys, a lot of guys, I feel like a lot of guys, um, I feel like they don't want to change. They're just trying to find a female that can adapt to their um, behavior, their habits, and it's like... I'm not telling you to change. Obviously, change things that are necessary to change. Like, like be more attentive to a female. Like, I hate when guys are like, you know, like, I'm not used to being with a female. I'm not used to relationships. Okay, so you better get used to it if you want to talk to me. You know what I mean? So, I feel like guys need to stop making excuses for their actions. And I know guys may feel certain ways about females, but this video is strictly about guys just because it was requested. Okay. Um, not all guys are the same. I'm just talking about my experiences and what I've seen online. Um, don't sit here and keep playing a girl because it's like you're literally wasting your time. I think I feel like you're wasting your, your time even more than you're wasting the girl's time because you're really taking the time out to think, How can I play with this girl just to get what I want? Um, and it's like that you're doing too much at that point and it's like do you really want to keep playing females and then you're in your 30s and then you're in your 40s and you're in your 50s and then you're lonely like who is really gonna want you and y'all keep sleeping around with these females y'all gonna catch something like i don't i think a lot of you guys feel like it's a game like y'all just keep you know sleeping with females and it's like what are you waiting for like are you waiting to catch something like i just i just be so confused like you guys are like rabbits, like, you guys just, you guys just like, on everything, like just hop, 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 and y'all want wifey material, but you're not husband material, like, you need to be hubby material, carry yourself like a man, not like a boy, if you want to be taken seriously and you don't want to get played, you need to carry yourself in a more height maintenance way, to be honest, and I'm tired of these guys talking about Oh, I can't take you out on a date, but they're getting the next best pair of sneakers that come out. Like, y'all be on it. Y'all be on movies that come out. Oh, yeah, I want to see that movie. Oh, yeah, we out to this club next weekend with my with my homeboys. Y'all be on it with that, but y'all don't be on it with taking a girl out to eat. And it's so sad. Like, it's so sad. And that's basically it, on guys, on the stuff that I've been through. Like girls i understand i've been through a lot <clears throat> excuse me i've been through a lot with guys i've been played you're not alone i already know the game and i'm young i'm 23 i've been through a lot of shit so it's like i can't play me no more so yeah so that's basically it for my little advice or rant about guys and relationships um i think i could say more but i'm gonna cut this video short Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, follow me on my Snapchat and my Instagram. I'll leave them up here. Turn on your post notifications so you guys can be alert whenever I post a video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.